Hi guys, welcome back to Rags to Riches. I'm Lauren and today's video That's annoying. <laughs> I'm gonna shut the window actually. Um today's video is home bargains haul. I've spent £61.42. I do it like every time. So I just thought, you know what guys, I'm just gonna show you what I've got. <laughs> um first off we've got four ninety nine marble like bin, like a toilet bin. <laughs> we just really need one upstairs. I'm just sick of having like a plastic bag hung up somewhere upstairs. It just looks not great. Um, it's just a load of random stuff today, guys. Luke said a pound. <laughs> uh, what else we got? I am obsessed with shake and vac. Cleaners, this one, especially the vanilla and magnolia one. Um, they're just 99p. I'm reading off the receipt and it's so sunny, I can't even see. <laughs> so yeah, they're just 99p and I literally could use a whole one of these in one room. It just smells so nice, I just like it so much. Um, then we've got Hershey's Cookies and Cream, some American chocolate. Um, my partner likes that, so he's got that. Um, we've got some candles. This one is Sun Kissed Cherry, and it proper smells of cherry. Uh, this one is Strawberry Cheesecake. This one's my favourite one. They've got Minute. Um, they're two ninety nine each, and they're just like Yankee Candles or um, the other popular ones, Woodwick. Anyway, these just burn all the way through, they don't just smell at the top, they smell all the way down, so that's great, so you're getting your money's worth out of that, and everyone compliments me like, mm, it smells really nice, so yeah, uh, what else we got, I can't find where this is now, uh, bath time, foam soap for my little boy, that was 79p, so yeah, that's great, then we've got Comfort Strawberry and Lily. Um, this was, I can't see, the sun is blinding. One ninety nine, just for that. Um, and I'll probably use that for like my own clothes and like eBay clothes if they need washing as well. We'll just use my own. Um, surface wipe cleaners. I've got apple flavour and lemon and lime anti back surface wipes there's quite a lot there's 50 wipes i've got 100 wipes for a pound and if a toy or something needs cleaning then just get these easy simple done banana chips um one pound and nine pence um, i've started having weirdix well these are not really weirdix are they let's be honest these are one pound 85 um, so I have like two of these and I normally have a banana with them, but if I haven't got any bananas, I'll just have some banana chips. Same difference, does the same job. Um, I'm hoping these are okay, that there's nothing extra added in them. Oh, there's coconut, oh, there's sugar. Why didn't I look at these? It's added sugar. Oh well, I just won't put as many in. Um, so yeah, and then we've got, what else we've got? Egg fried rice, um, 49p each. <laughs> I just thought I'd try them. Um, where's my pen gone? I'm losing my mind today. So if I'm a pen, I'm just like scribble everything out. <laughs> For where we're up to. Um, I've started noticing that I'm getting like sunspots, like my freckles are coming out and I haven't been in the sun much so I'm just going to spray some Factor 15. I don't know if I'm going to get any more sun this August or not so yeah. Um, I don't know if I showed this. I think these were 3 Um. I've got the, the refillable ones, but I don't know, I don't know, it might have been 3 dollars I have no idea and I can't see it on here, no idea, 
idea. Anyway, I think it was three ninety nine, possibly. Oh yeah, they were three ninety nine. Um, jasmine and sandalwood. I don't know. I don't know, guys. Anyway, let's just get into it. Uh, what's next? Thought we should try some Pringles rice fusion Indian tandoori chicken masala flavor. That is a mouthful. Let's let's taste one. Let's see how nice they actually are. If we can get in it. nice I can taste all the flavors yeah they're definitely a buy if you want to ever get them they were 99p from home bargains definitely definitely get that um I'm like going through the receipt to see which one. Uh, so I got the black mask. I've had it before. It does work. So I've just got it again. For the old paws. Uh, that was $1.99. Uh, next we've got... I'm not organised, am I? <laughs> Every time I seem to go home bargains, which isn't very often, because I said to my partner, I was like, we need to go home bargains, what? And he said, you basically need to stock up on your candles. And I'm like, yeah, because that's the only place where I get my candles and I like burn them all day. They last for like 90 hours. So definitely 2 99 for 90 hours for the candle burning. You're spending like, what, 16 quid or 24 quid on a decent candle to burn that long and still smell. Anyway, I'm just obsessed with them. So the other thing that I always seem to get when I go to home bag is, is the fish and chips salt and vinegar. I just love these so much. These were 39p each. So that's really good. Because I get them every time. So it's just basically when we and I always get salt and vinegar. Love salt and vinegar. I'm mouth watering just thinking about it. What the hell are they? This must be it. Dog treats. They are bacon flavour and they do smell quite nice. I once fed one of the... <laughs> it was... When was it? 2015 Christmas, we lived in a flat. We're paying rent. Um, I was pregnant and... These made me throw up whenever I smelt them. But um, <laughs> we had like a little Christmas party and it... And he, he said to him, I was like, if you eat one, we'll pay for your Indian. Because it seemed to be an Indian open on Christmas Day around our area. So he said, yeah, I'll do it. And he ate it. And then he asked for more. He asked for more. <laughs> Apparently these are quite nice. <laughs> yeah, so that was a very, very long time ago. Um, as soon as though I'm off for two weeks, we got this for our little boy. He's obsessed with dinosaurs, pirates, anything like that sort of thing. He's proper little boy. So, yeah, we got him this. This was £1.49. And it's so much to do when we're off work. Because we're not going on holiday this year. Because we're obviously still saving up for our wedding, which is next year. And we won't be going away next year while we're off work. So, um, an ombre weekly planner oh i know which one it is so i thought this could help with um i'm just looking because i can like neighbors can see me <laughs> yeah so a weekly planner so like a to-do list i'm obsessed with lists if you haven't seen on instagram i am obsessed with lists so this is just great i don't know how many sheets there is uh, probably 52 probably um, this was 99p. So basically it says like calls and emails, who do I need to like contact? So that's great. 
um, urgent, obviously like probably doctor's appointment, stuff like that. Um, and I might just like Monday, Tuesday and that. I might put like what's going off on that day. So maybe like, um, I don't know if I've got the dentist or something, but I will try and probably put meals on this. That's why I kind of got it for meal, meal prep, that sort of thing. So yeah, that's not bad for night IMP. It does seem really thick look. So I'm guessing there's like 52. Um, let me just scribble out so I know how much things cost. Uh, next we've got some battery. Um, I had nearly got a pack, which was seven ninety nine. Can you believe it? Anyway, I found these um, for ninety nine p, triple uh, A and double A, so that's great. Um, what else we got? What the hell is that? Got some bleach because I'm cleaning the bathroom in a minute. So yeah, I'll just douse that everywhere. Um, I got some food containers for meal prep. They were, I think they were five nine. No, five nine nine. Are you joking? You think I'm paying that? Uh, there's five of them, and they were one pound fifty nine. Yeah, it's not bad. They're quite big actually. Let's have a look. Sorry, don't like squeaky noises. Ain't gonna fill me. <laughs> that is not gonna fill me. Why did I not think of that? Anyway, it says it's dishwasher safe, safe, freezer safe. Is it oven safe? No. Dishwasher safe, freezer safe, and microwave safe. It's just not oven safe. <laughs> but yeah, that's not that bad. I'm quite happy with that. Um Oh, this one looks good. So because obviously you know I'm getting married next year, I'm an organised freak. Well, I'm not very organised with this receipt business. But I've got a seating plan. Organised set, including two large graph paper sheets, table templates and 120 seat labels and stickers. Oh, I'm going to have fun with this. <laughs> so just open it. So it comes like this. Um, I can't seem to get in it. Oh, so that's quite good. Right. So it comes with... Here we're coming to the big day. Guest list. And then a huge... Oh my gosh. A huge map, basically. And then this is the table template. So then you've got different sizes. So you've got, obviously your top table, you just draw it on wherever you want. That's quite good. Then I'm guessing these are your name places to like stick around in a circle, I guess. Um, I don't know why, but there's two of these in there. Maybe one's a draft. Maybe. No idea. Anyway, I just thought that was really good because I kind of need that so that I can like stick somewhere. Stick it up somewhere. I don't know where, but I'll put it somewhere. Um basically what I'm doing with my invites is I am sending them table by table. Um so that I can keep on top of it. So basically I'll send like table one out, and if I haven't heard back in two weeks then i'll start message them then i will send after two weeks i will probably send out table two number two weeks table three that sort of thing i'm saying that i'll do that but i don't know um i'm going to start sending them out soon just because people need to book hotels and stuff um so yeah this was i don't know if i told you it 99p yeah 99p for that so 
that's pretty good organizing um you might have two in there because you might have to send one off to like the person who's doing your table plan the actual table plan but yeah that's quite good just for i need to be organized with stuff like this because it's a joke so yeah that was 99p i'm scribbling out again right next one is a lint remover this was 199 um this takes two double a batteries not included so yeah that's pretty much why i got batteries um i'm gonna my partner's got some trousers that i'm gonna test it out on apparently it's amazing um and i just think if i buy something don't notice that it, it's it's got lint on it then i can just use this so i'll let you know on instagram whether it's good or not all it's got is an on and off button and then obviously the bit the lint bit to pick it up uh, what else we got um some more wedding stuff these i got three packs of these these are signs um so if you if you haven't already watched some of my videos then i am having um an alice in wonderland themed wedding it's not themed as where everyone's going to be wearing costumes it's just like the decor is all themed around alice in wonderland um because i am crazy if you want to know why um so anyway if, i've seen on pictures at the venue people seem to decorate the the driveway so uh, the driveway is loads of trees on either side as you're going down and i thought it'd be really good to have some arrows on the trees saying party well just arrows it didn't have to say anything on it to be honest so these packs have got party in them and this way so that's kind of perfect for my theme for and that only cost me what three pound just to decorate the outside of the venue so yeah that's not bad really um and you get in a pack you get five in a pack um so yeah that should that should be enough i'm quite pleased with that and they're made out of cardboard not wood if you're wondering so they'll probably just get up put up the morning of the wedding just in case it like rains overnight or something and then they just go all soggy and awful and destroyed <laughs> so yeah there's the other two um why so we've got these four pack of little bottles um these are just for decor for the table um i believe I've got enough now. I don't know if we're doing these as favours or not. I can't remember. I just know I needed two more packs. Um, yeah, I think it's the favours. I can't remember. So anyway, they were 79p each. Um, so that's pretty good, really. Uh, the next one is for packaging. This one cost me 79p. I should have got another one, really. I didn't realise how cheap they actually was. Um, yeah, these won't really last me that long. There, there isn't much on the roll. But it'll do. It will do. Uh, what else have we got? We're running out of stuff, guys, to show you. <laughs> oh, a partner. Right, this is going to sound really strange. So... This is my partner's hairbrush that we bought um, because I broke his brushing one of them porcelain dolls um, hair because my my friend, my best mate, had a load of dolls. I was like, you need to sell them. The new Annabelle films come out. I said, you need to stay the haunted. So she brought them round. We fixed the hair. We cleaned them up with wipes. Took pictures on a creepy chair that I have. I don't even know where the chair Oh, the chair's upstairs. It's like a little kid's wooden chair, so obviously it's creepy. Um, 
and I'm brushing this doll there and it, it broke the brush. <laughs> so yeah, so we've got him that. That was 99p. Um, I'm trying to see what else. Uh, eyelash curler, £1.29. Um, I don't know where mine's gone, so I just got a new one. You know what? I don't think many people actually clean these. So I don't many people don't even clean the brushes, but I probably clean my brushes maybe once a month, something like that. I don't wear makeup every day as you can tell. Um yeah, so if you if you're washing your brushes, make sure you wash this. Or you'll get conjunctivitis. Um Oh, I bought a bubble gun. Is it here? No, anyway, we bought a, bu a bubble gun uh, for my little boy. That cost one ninety nine. just to be make him quiet. 99p, cleaning the bathroom, like I said, in a minute. So we'll get that sorted. And then we got a family pack of plasters. Um... They were one ninety nine. There were some. There were some cheaper ones, but they. I think it were like Chase, like Paw Patrol Chase ones, and they were only eight in a packet for seventy nine p. I think, and this is a forty pack. Um, it, it says it's got Mickey Mouse on them. I don't know. One of the plain. Ah, they're all mixed, so it's a family pack, so there's mixed ones. And then there's... And also, girls, if you're watching, put get some plasters, just get some plasters and stick them in every single clutch bag you have, and even handbag. Because I always have like an emergency backpack type of situation going off if I go out. So I've got this like roller thing. To stop blisters if you feel blister like starting to rub coming on uh, you sick you roll this thing on it, it come it stops it basically forming into a blister so that's good so yeah um that's pretty much everything i can't believe i spent 61 pound i didn't even buy that many things that was expensive the most expensive thing i bought was like 3.99 that's how that's how crazy i does anyone else do that? It's like, oh, it's 99p, put it in, it's 99p, put it in, put it in, put it in, put it in. Turns out 60 quid later. So, yeah. I need help. <laughs> anyway, guys, I'm not really going to film many of these hauls type of thing. I might do them every now and again. I don't go to home bargains that often. I'm not going to go weekly just to do you a haul. It's not happening. Because, you know, saving money at the end of the day, I'm just showing you what I've got. Because I've, I've got a lot. <laughs> So yeah, I hope you have uh, some great sales today. I hope you're not in the Donut Club. If you don't know what the Donut Club is, you need to go onto Instagram and check it out and check my, my page out. And the guy who invented the Donut Club is called 49 Irish Flips. And he should be telling you a little bit more about that as well. Um, so yeah, I hope you have some great sales and stay at the Donut Club. And don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for watching. Bye.